Hi guys, welcome to ASFN. I'm Quentin Lowe. We're fishing an exciting venue in Joburg. Um, I'm joined by a very well-known angler, Neville Barnard. Um, Neville Barnard is, I recommend, is one of the best specimen anglers in South Africa. One of the best. Um, he will be telling you, we just arrived at the venue. We've been here about 15 minutes and um, we were busy with this, with the rod still and about 15 minutes we were into this beauty. And um, yeah, welcome Neville. Thank you very much, nice to join you here. Uh, like I said, we just cast out the rods right now. About 15 minutes I had this fish, we just waited. It weighed 7.7 .7 kilos. Just take it by the tail, push it forward. Keep it until it goes on its own steam. We're doing a 24 hour session and um, hopefully we can catch some big big and nice fish and um, hopefully Neville can uh, share some tips with us. And Neville, yeah, what's, what's your approach for this weekend? My approach for this weekend will exclusively be with boilies. I have pre-baited the day before with boilies, different sizes between 20 and 24 mils. And I'm fishing from single hook baits to double hook baits, pop-ups, snowman rigs on a feeding area and some of the rods off feeding areas so we'll see what happens. Okay, the, the lake has been quite conditioned on a lot of boilies and um, the fish have definitely seen a lot of rigs and um, that's why I say you must always be on top of your game and um, I think Neville is one of those guys always he never does the same thing and um, hopefully yeah we'll see what happens this weekend. This is the second morning of our se session at the lake with me and Quinton and this is the result early this morning a 9.7 kilo common carp Beautiful, beautiful fish Immaculate condition It's always better to keep them a little while let them go off on their own steam but this, I think this one is ready already Most of my fishing is done with a combi link setup and combined with a jockey rig. Um, I'll explain how to make this now. First of all, you have your supple link, maybe a 10 centimeter length. On this, you put your boilie. Now that you've got your boilie on, you can take your hook, you can thread your supple link through your hook and judge the distance. I like it half a centimeter to a centimeter away from the hook, like this. Then what you do is you go to the hook, the, 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 the point of the hook in a backwards motion, three times around the shank. You take the hair back, you wind it another three times and then back down and back through the hook and you get a setup that looks like this. It's called a jockey rig. And this I combine with a combi link setup. So I'm going to use my stiff boom material and fasten the two together now. You make a normal figure eight, just a normal, normal figure eight. You pull your supper link all the way up. You wind it up six or seven times. Then you wind it back another two or three times and through the loop that you made you end up with something that looks like this you got a stiff boom section that throws your bait away from your sinker after you've cast and you got your supple link section at the front that helps for hooking potential on this portion you just cut it to the length you need I'm not fishing silt at the moment I'm, it's quite a hard gravel bottom so I'm not going to make a very long boom section you put on an anti-tangle sleeve thread it down make a normal figure 8 again at the top And 
you just fasten everything nice and tight you cut your tug ends off and you just pull your rubber over the knot to make it a little bit more neat and this you can put onto a quick link or anything and there you are combi link combined with a jockey rig